This is America. We have the founding fathers that wrote the Constitution that we haven't lived by in 142 years. Everybody, y'all seeing my little pot belly. That's as good as it gets because she weighs about about 45 pounds and she don't like to be picked up very often. So, come here. Sit down. Sit down for everybody. Show everybody you can sit down. Sit. Come on. Sit. Sit down. Oh, sit down. Come here. Sit down. Sit down. But you'll sit any other time, but right now you ain't gonna sit. Are you in the grass? Is that why you won't sit down? Huh? Sit down. Sit down. Sit. Sit. Well, come here. You can sit down. Good girl. That's my good girl. Here you go, baby. All right, everybody. That's my little baby pop belly. Hello, everybody. How are you? Now, y'all see my little pop belly. I made that video because this person on Facebook asked me if she'd love to see my pop belly. Now she's playing with the tripod, of course. Uh, but anyway, I figured I'd make the little video and show her a little bit. And uh, there she goes trying to knock over the pot, the thing now. But anyway, isn't it wonderful about all the news that's out there, folks? I mean, are we getting it done? I mean, are we getting it done? We sure are. I just, for the life of me, folks, I don't get it anymore. I don't. It's a damn shame that we, the people, can't make a major push for our freedoms like we make a major push for the newest, brightest outlook story. You know, it's not that the story is not important. It isn't how you present it. You can show people when you present a story why, how, and how it is affecting our freedoms and why it is affecting our freedoms and what angle of propaganda that they're using against you to make you want to be corporate for them. That's the whole ball of wax right there. It, it really is. Y'all know it. I know it. The whole world knows it. But we're too busy, like you hear the kids in the background playing basketball, football, going to concerts, dances with stars, American Idol, all of those big hoop de da television shows that you watch. We're too busy working our job and when we come home we don't want to do a little bit more. We don't want to work anymore. Oh, there's other people out there doing it for us. Yeah, but what you don't understand is the ones that are really doing it are all blocked. Blocked in so many different ways it doesn't even, it ain't even funny anymore. It's to the point that I'm ready to give up. You know why? Because no one is willing to share the information nor push the information <coughs> <coughs> I'm 
so why should I? That's just straight up. You know, I could have got in here and made you a UFO video. Boy, there's plenty of them out there. Real fake or indifferent or trick photography, it doesn't matter, does it? It can all be done. Uh, have you looked in the mirror lately? Are you real? I'm being straight up. Do you, are you real? Do you look the same as you did yesterday? Was you cloned overnight and not even know it? Hmm. Was you asleep in a metrics tank somewhere and they got all these probes probed into you? Do you know that for sure? Where did you come from? Do you know that for sure? Or you just living on faith? That's all you got. But is this world real? With all of the condemning words that one person or a hundred people may use or thousands of them may use. All of them may raise words. It doesn't matter. I don't care what kind of word it is. Whatever word that they want to turn against you at any given moment in any given moment of time. That's just straight up. Do you want to be free? Do you want to get away from that? I'm going to give you a solution to some of that right now. Number one, do not buy a home in a homeowners association. If you have one, get out of it while you can before people catch on to it and sell out and that's all you got and you can't sell yours. That's number one to break their back. Number two, move out of the cities if you can. Move into the suburbs into a, on a piece of property somewhere. Fence it off. Make it yours. Oh, you say oh, that won't do no good. It will damn well help. It may it won't stop it, no. But it will help. Get out of homeowners associations while you still can. Don't ever buy one there. Ever. All it is is rules. More rules and more rules tell you that you can't flag an American flag in your front yard whatever the case may be whatever reason they have you don't want to have no part of that ever and before you buy a house don't see an attorney I mean see one at the time but when you get the contract you tell them you want two days to read that contract over everything that you do not understand you yell align it because you're going to sit there for an hour signing your name. Check it out very thoroughly. Anything that is not in your wishes, you want to get changed immediately. And if they don't want to deal with that and they say, well, we're going back, we'll say, they go, okay. It's like this, folks. If you don't start fighting for your freedoms, you're not going to have none. In other words, every contract that you're going to get before long is going to be signed here or we won't do nothing for you. You know, you can't even go to a car lot anymore with cash money and buy a vehicle and bicker with the price anymore because the way they've got it all rigged. They better sell it to you on time because you have to sign your little name on that dotted line. That's your little corporate name. So they make more money. They don't care about your rights. They don't care about their own. They don't even know what they're doing to you because they're that dumb too. So with that, folks, I hope you enjoyed this. And if you do, please subscribe. Our, from my cold, dead hands, abolish corporate government for your freedoms. Much love to y'all. Y'all have a great day and work on your freedoms and help other people do the same.
Much love. Don't forget to follow Tattoo1009.com on Facebook and Twitter and YouTube and Dan Lemotion and stumble upon. Please help spread the word by sharing our articles on your favorite social networks. Go to the links in the below section for updates every day. From my cold dead hands abolish the corporate government.